Today, we're diving into promises and the power of async await in JavaScript. First, let's talk about promises. Here's a simple example. We have a function called fetch data with promise. This function returns a promise. Inside the promise, we simulate a delay using set timeout. After two seconds, the promise is resolved with the string data fetched. We can handle the result of this promise using the dot then method and catch any errors with dot catch. Now, let's make it even simpler with async await. In the fetch data with async await function, we simply use the await keyword to wait for the promise to resolve. If there's an error, we catch it with a try catch block. And that's a quick introduction to promises and async botch await in JavaScript. Try using them in your next project.